Hey guys, today we are going to be making a clay cactus pinch pot. So when you get your clay, the first thing you wanna do is really squish and squeeze it to get those air bubbles out. Then you're going to separate it into two pieces. Now the first piece you are going to roll into a smooth ball to make a pinch pot. To make a pinch pot, you need to press your thumb into the center of the ball and then pinch while you turn the ball in a circle. This will open up the center of the pinch pot. Once you have your pinch pot open, you can smooth and shape it. With the extra clay you've saved aside, take a small chunk for a coil. You're going to roll this into a long snake, then using water as glue, you're going to coil the snake on the bottom of your pinch pot. Once you have it firmly pressed onto the bottom of your pot, you're going to smooth it out. Once the bottom is smoothed out, use a small clay tool to write your name on the bottom of your pot. Now you'll take your remaining clay and divide it up to make cactus. I'm going to make three separate cactus. For the first cactus, I'm rolling it into a thick snake and I'm using a clay tool to draw lines for texture. My second cactus is a small round barrel cactus. Again, I'm using clay tools for texture and I'm rolling two small balls for the top. To add the two little balls on top, I'm using slip or wet clay water. This acts as a glue and holds the pieces together. For my third cactus, I'm adding an arm onto it. To attach the arm, I need to use that clay water again as glue. Before I put my cactus into my pot, I'm going to smooth it out and add some details. When I'm ready to add my cactus into my pot, the first thing I need to do is score and slip. Scoring is making scratches in the surface of the clay where you're going to stick the pieces together, and slip is that wet clay water. First, I scratch the inside of the pot and the bottom of each cactus, then I rub that wet clay water where I'm going to stick them together. This is clay glue. If I don't score and slip, my pieces will not stay together when they're fired in the kiln. Making sure to firmly press all the cactus in, I'm going to add my final details and textures to make sure it looks good. And there I have my clay cactus pinch pot. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and like.